How you guys doing? You gotta check out this crazy ground beetle. How you guys doing? I'm Chris Ignato and you are watching Nature Now. So this video is about a wild group of ground beetles known as the caterpillar hunters, the Callosoma genus. In fact, this species, the fiery searcher, is Callosoma scrutator, and they are incredible. You'll see how it gets its name in a few seconds. Their elytra, or first pair of wings, which are the hardened covers used to protect the actual wings used for flight, are a beautiful metallic green. Looking at their legs, you can see that they must achieve some pretty high speeds when running across the ground. And speaking of their legs, their undersides, along with their thorax, is a wonderful assortment of iridescent rainbows. These beetles can be really fast. I mean, they are a type of ground beetle, right? And a lot of ground beetles can scurry across the ground quite quickly. They're often found under debris, rocks and logs and leaf litter, and they love to burrow. I have seen these beetles climbing up trees and bushes to get to their prey, but they are generally ground hunters. You know, they are terrestrial hunters and that's their territory. Fiery searchers are actually considered beneficial insects and that of course is because they like to feed on larvae and caterpillars and other things that can harm the agricultural industries and forests and all sorts of greenery. Usually feed at night which makes them nocturnal and they love the soft-bodied larvae, including canker worms, mealworms, caterpillars, and other larvae. The fiery searcher here will also feed on crickets and other things. When a beetle finds its prey, it just quickly overpowers them and starts to shred them to pieces with those powerful jaws. And it's kind of intimidating to actually watch it. When these beetles are disturbed, they have two defense mechanisms. One of them, of course, are those formidable jaws. And as you see, they can be pretty nasty and deliver a kind of powerful bite. The second mechanism is the ability to emit these foul oils from their joints and maybe other parts of their bodies. I actually think they get those oils from consuming caterpillars. As you might know, a lot of caterpillars have some toxic or noxious chemicals and stuff within those spines that cover their bodies. It's a wonderful defense mechanism and as I said, I think that might be how the beetle gets its oils to defend itself. Their life cycle is generally about a year from egg to adult, but the adults can live up to two or three years, which is actually pretty long as far as beetles go. Wow, isn't that a marvelous looking beetle? I mean, I just love that metallic green back and then that iridescent rainbow colored thorax. Just really striking colors, especially once the sunlight hits them. As you might know, I'm partial to those colors and in insects. So I hope you guys like this video. If you see one of these fiery searchers on the ground, you know, if you're lucky enough, try to have a close look at it, but it's probably gonna take off and you probably don't wanna handle it because they do deliver quite a nasty pinch. Thanks a lot for watching guys. Once again, I'm Chris Ignato, signing out. Thanks a lot for watching, and remember, if you like this video, be sure to check out this video over here that YouTube has selected specifically for you based on your watch time. And don't forget to hit that subscribe button, but you gotta click the bell icon, because if you don't, YouTube will never let you know when a new video of mine comes out. And remember, passion inspires spirit.